Hello, folks, and welcome to Protection Paladin, my main spec. We are on the quest to complete the Mage Tower for every spec in the game. Obviously not Evokers. As my main spec, I do have some current stuff like the Sark Trinket. And, uh, you know, I, I can kind of play the spec a little bit better than maybe some others. It really feels like it has plenty of tools for this fight. Uh, you'll notice I did take Turn Evil. I don't think I use it on this one, but you can actually fear the Infernals, which is not nothing, you know, to get them going the other way, especially if you have more than one. There's Divine Toll, right? You'll also notice I took Quickened Invocation, which is a cooldown reduction on Divine Toll. Now, it doesn't match the adds, but it's like a five-second offset, meaning in a pinch, if you're late on adds, it'll be back up and you can press it. Um, Traditionally, that's only going to be available every other set of ads, right? Don't know why I don't fear this guy, but maybe I was just bored of doing it. Anyway, keeping the infernal in like the middle, just to make sure that if he if he hits me, I'm I'm coming from like the furthest spot from any of the edges. And here's the ads. And see, here's exactly that situation. Toll's coming up now, and the ads aren't dead. I don't want to tank for any amount of time. Don't tank those things. The side talents debuff will kill you. It increases the damage their melees, which have added arcane damage deal to you. So don't so don't do that. Now usually we would wait for a better opportunity to push Ferris. But I'm pretty sure I push Ferris right during an ad spawn. I don't recommend doing that. That's likely either a laziness or I don't know, confidence. Also 12 stacks, right? So I'm dead dead. I do have a 1.5k shield and 700 health. I might have survived one. But yeah, this is all bad. Good thing they give us orbs. I have four. <laughs> you don't double orb. You don't want to you don't want to tank those things. And again, Divine Toll coming up now. I can just bubble this though. And since I'm bubbled, I don't have to panic toll the ads. I can just keep it for the next set. Now, Cruel, we're looking at three Annihilates, so we're going to go, like, nothing, but I guess that was Bubble. Ardent Defender, the second one. Guardian, the third one. If you had to go four, you would just push that all back one, and you'd be fine. If you're going five, then I don't I don't know what's going on, but you would just add Bubble as the fifth and not use it to kind of, as, like, a quality of life tool. Anyway, the pre-freedom there is to help get out of the puddle. Uh, I was I was almost off on anticipating that. Here comes ads. Stun's coming up from our cooldown reduction. We're going to stun Cruel because the ads are coming and it always takes a lot of heat off you. Dive onto the orb. I think the Infernal was like hard. No, okay. He did get DR'd. Infernal just does what it wants. The ground effect doesn't damage the Velen. Um, so, like... You know, you don't have to worry about that, but you do want to keep that area clean so you can get your orb efficiently without having to have freedom. And again, stun, full heal, word of glory, and then delete. That's protection, Paladin. We'll see you tomorrow with another challenge. If you want to see one spec before I randomly get to it, let me know in the comments while you're down there. Like and subscribe. Don't worry about that, though.